All right, guys, I have an insane workout for you today. This is part of my two-day training series. So right now, the last few weeks, last month, I've only been training two days per week, and I've been making amazing gains. I feel strong, recharged, I'm hitting PRs, and my body actually thrives on two very intense training days. So today, I'm gonna be crushing the shoulders, do a little bit of back, tricep and the quad. So this will be a really, really good workout. Now with a two day split, I'm not hitting every single angle. Funny enough, I make my best gains when I strip it down to the bare essential. So you could look at the program and be like, well, you're missing this, you're missing that. Doesn't matter. When you get stronger in these key movements, your physique transforms. And I have pretty good back development. I'm more focused on the shoulder. So I've crafted the training towards my goals. Now this system is inside the Movie Star Body Masterclass. The full system, the different exercise rotations and strategies to improve. So if you want the full system, you want to be inside the Movie Star Body Masterclass. It's right inside the members area. So I really like the Arnold press for the shoulders. You really feel it across the entire shoulder. When I do the Arnold press, I like to come down nice and deep, get a good stretch. And then as I come up, I rotate. You feel it all across the shoulders. So I started this off about 55 pounds. These are adjustable dumbbells, so it's really 60 pounds. And I knocked out about eight reps. Felt absolutely killer. And then I went down to about 50s for about 10 reps. And you know what? That's really all my shoulders needed. I've actually been experimenting with just doing two sets. I feel a bit more fresh. I hit PRs easier. So I'm just doing two sets while I'm cutting to a lower body fat. So I still have a little bit of elbow tendonitis. So I'm not going crazy heavy on the weighted chin-ups. I'm just doing body weight. But one of the techniques to really build your arms on chin-ups is actually to do the commando chin-up from the military. This is where you grab the bar here and you come side to side. And what happens is the further your arms are away from your body, the more you activate the lats. And so if you have a good V-shape and you want to put more size on the biceps, you actually want to do closer grip chin-ups and pull-ups. But the way you can get even more bicep activation, especially the brachialis, is coming, bringing the hands all the way to the center line and doing a commando, going side to side. So the first set, I knocked out 20 reps, which was pretty damn crazy. I did 20, rested about 45 seconds, then I knocked about 12. And after that, my biceps were toast. I just hit a couple more sets, about six reps. So now we're going to a little bit of leg training. I've been keeping my leg training super minimalist because I found that when I hit my legs very, very hard, it's harder for me to really improve and push the limits on my upper body strength and size while staying lean. So I took a strategy out of my 2015, 2016 playbook to put legs into minimalist mode. So all I'm doing on this workout is just some ATG split squats, which are good for the knees and good at developing the VMO and up the quads. So I'm just doing four sets, ATG split squats. So I'm just doing the minimum effective dose to really maintain my legs while really getting my upper body to the next level. Now, when you train legs, you actually get a little bit of a hormonal boost that you can take advantage of. So that's why I'm gonna be doing the lateral raises right after this leg exercise to really capitalize on that. The lateral raises, I'm gonna do some leaning laterals, just two sets. I'm doing about 15 reps on the first set and then about eight to 10 reps on the second set really stressing the shoulders out and building those big shoulders. So with the lean, what happens is normally you do shoulder raises and the first few inches are pretty easy and then right here, it feels really tough. But when you lean and you're right here, that first few inches are a lot harder. So you really, really feel it in the shoulders. A really good movement to mix it up. If you're doing regular lateral raises, try the lean. It's gonna crush the shoulders. It's gonna hit a little bit of traps too. Really good movement. Usually been training at home at the gym today, so I'm gonna add a little bit of an extra rope push down, just two sets to give my triceps a little bit more work. But honestly, normally on this two day routine, I don't even do the tricep work. And I've just been getting stronger, easier on presses without adding in that extra tricep work, which is interesting enough. So that's the workout today. Absolutely awesome. If you want the full blown system, you wanna be part of the Movie Star Body Masterclass. This is where I'm adding in new routines every few months. And right now, this is what I've been crushing on. The very minimalist, two day split. Now there's some research that actually shows that some people actually respond better to very, very low volume. I am one of those people where I actually, if you look historically over the last 10 years, I have made the fastest improvement doing very little, either doing two workouts a week, quite minimalist or three and just a few exercises, a couple sets 
very minimalist. Now in the movie star body mass class, you have a few different phases. You have your strength and proportion phase. You also have your shrink wrap phase, which is very, very high volume. I'll do that once a year to fill out quickly, but I plateau and I just get my, my biggest base and gains I make is just so minimal. So everyone that's gone through that full movie star body four month routine, do the minimalist. You're gonna see that the PRs come really easy. And as you get strong in these movements, your physique improves. And this routine is just building my shoulders and arms like nothing else. Make no mistake, I'm getting sharper and I'm gonna be doing another hormonal analysis with Derek for more plates, more dates. Um, I'm working on a few little things to optimize my total and free testosterone levels. So this will be very, very interesting. See you guys soon.